Hello everyone and welcome back to GTA 5. Um so basically <clears throat> hopefully in this episode uh we can get the heist done. Um so there's, there is a heist coming up. But we will before the heist we will have to um get the stuff for it, which won't probably won't take long because you know, um it didn't really take that long to get this stuff for it, but you know, in my case I'm not a very good driver. So yeah, but yeah, um, if you guys enjoy this episode and you want to see more, just hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. And um, yeah, let's get into it. So what are we doing? Um, Leicester, so let's go to Michael for that. Alright, um, let's mark, mark it, go, and let's go. Who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. Ow. Okay. Hey, it's daylight. The hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail, the Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. It hasn't been yet. I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Well, gems it is then. Let's go to Vangelico and buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, he went quiet. <laughs> you don't know who that is. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. Okay. Let's head to the shore. On little Portola. I'll do all the work. You sit in the car doing nothing. Great. Here we are. Ah, okay. Are you kidding? I totally nailed that audition. This place be is nice. so big, People man. looked where they're going. Like I... Are you reading me? Mm-hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Sir, thank you. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. Uh... Ah, okay, that's their alarm. Can you get me an air vent and one of the cameras? Air vent and one of the cameras. Yeah, that's the air vent. Great, you got the security camera and the ventilation in that shot. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. 
Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe 10 grand. Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Our music is back. Like I care. Hey there. Can't wait to meet up later. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Okay. Construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. This job is only half done. Get some images of the right, roof, please. Right, I'm going, I'm going. Right, you're well placed to take the photo of the system now. That's it. Take the shot and we're finished. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Oh. Okay, that will do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Will do. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe it remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Uh, good. Alarm systems linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window. Someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof. Means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then. Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. I might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. <laughs> Here are the photo. Uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> Nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't wanna leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options, showing you all the angles, that's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that, is your domain, my friend. Here. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LS. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. 
The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the L.S. River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Um... Let's play it smart. Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind, as ever. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Toe. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but... This is the person who will determine how long you get inside. Um, let's go for that. He seems more capable. Harris! <laughs> good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. That look good to you? Are you sure? Yeah. Great. I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good, good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more. You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. Okay. Mission path, nice. What's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful, and the risk will be high, but you might learn something if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog, but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you can put together your own deals, your own jobs. So... <laughs> There's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. Okay. Now we just gotta wait. bug inspection but what if there ain't an infestation I'm make sure there's an infestation this dude's packing he's got a weapon we have a 503 and bug start go 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 That's simple. Oh, didn't even see the car there.
All right, Lester, we got a pest control van. Good. I've got Wait. a line on the knockout gas. It's made in some lab on the coast, but two shipments a day come through the city from the northeast, taking it to the airport. All right. I'll see if I can jump one. It's a long drive. I <laughs> hate long drivers. Drives. Hey. Do we've got to say? Hey, Lest. I got the good night gas. That's it looks like the microphone Bob can't be used right now. Go. Try again later. I do apologize about that. Now we all know why we're here. We've got a store to take. The plan is simple, elegant. Listen to Lester, pay attention to the information he gives you, and we'll all make a buck. If things go bad, you know the drill. This wasn't organized. We don't know each other. We got caught up in a robbery and acted in self-defense. But it's not going to be an issue, because everything's going to go just fine. The, um, the uh, alarm system is easy. Now, if I didn't need to be running things, I could have it offline myself, no problem, but uh, you should be able to get us a pretty decent window. How decent depends on the job you do. Now, uh, once it's down, you signal Michael, he makes the call. Things look good, we should be able to drop a present right through the air vent on the roof. Everybody goes to sleep, no problem. We take our time. If we run into trouble, we move quickly and with force. Any questions? No? Let's go. Frank, you're with me. Paige, you're in the truck with the bikes. Gus, Eddie, you're in the van, all right? It's in the car. See you on Little Portolo, people. Initials only from here on out. F, come on, get in. Too much gas on these guys, you'll kill them. Well, shit, don't blame me the way these canisters is mixed. Just be careful. <sighs> yeah, okay. Listen, I stuck my neck out for you here. Man, you don't need to tell me that shit again. I got Man. faith in you, F, but you're unproven. Unproven? For real? So I didn't prove myself when I jumped off the back of that yacht on the highway, huh? Yeah, but these guys don't know you. They see some gangbanger with a happy... What the fuck? With a happy trigger finger. They got money and their freedom on the line. I ain't gonna fuck this up, man. Good. I got enough shit to worry about. What you got to worry about? I don't know. I ain't done any real work in years, you know? So I'm giving half the take to guys who are supposed to be the best in the business. All right. Then it's all taken care of. You on top of shit? Yeah, do I need to give 12% to a gunman? 14% to a driver? 15 to a hacker? And that's on top of all the other outlets. I feel like a chump buying myself a score. Shit. I guess we'll find out if they worth it, right? All right, this is it up there. Oh, shit. Oh, what is he doing? This is it up there. There's a way through the site up to the roof. Man, we went over this. I'm cool. Hey. All right, when the gas is in the ventilation system, give us the word. For sure, man. We go. I got it. Hello? Exterminators here? Hey, there ain't no one around. That suits us. Come on, get up to the roof. Get your ass out of here. Get your ass out of here. <laughs> 
Uh. Almost there. We're in position, waiting on your signal. Just gotta get where I can throw this. This one, right. Yeah, there we go. That was it. They going out. You love her. Well, I, I love her a lot. I just, I wasn't thinking it was. Well, think about it like this. I mean, I always say that. I told them to fix that goddamn AC. What's going on? Yeah, there we go. All right, that's our target. Keep it up. See how much we can get. Come on, let's clear this place out. How you doing over there? Half a minute left. Not a lot of time left. This better not be paced. Keep it up. I'm on it, Holmes. 20 seconds. Keep moving. How we doing? How we doing? Let's go. Let's go. We're on the clock. Get a thousand things every day, pal. Make sure this is one of them. I'll see you at the river. Go. It's go time! Let's go, guys. Stay safe. Let's go. We got a sharp left coming up on Dorset Drive. Come on! Shut up, Ben.
Don't worry, I got you. Go, go, go! No. Fine work, boss. All right, we got a window. Let's stop at the end of the river, get the bikes in the truck. Yeah, come on, get in. Lester's waiting for us at the lockup. Go to the lockup. Okay. It was a good takedown. Here's to the first of many. That's it. Put it in the bay. Yeah. All right, people. We need to split up. They're going to be looking for a crew. I'll wire your cuts when the rocks have been sold. That shit was crazy, dog. So what now? We get out of here. Keep our heads down. Hey, you did good, kid. What'd I tell you, Lester, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, look, everybody take off. Hey, Franklin. Listen, Lester and I got some things we gotta clean up. I want you to stop by the house a little later on. We'll celebrate, all right? All right. Okay. <laughs> huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. We're back in action. I passed the jewel store job. Nice. I don't care if you got money now. Don't you get it? That ain't what I was looking for. Not then, not now, not ever. I know it ain't important. Just let me take you somewhere nice, all right? Where are you? Uh, are you in a strip club? Grow up. Stop looking for the easy way. Tanisha, I gotta go, all right? Uh, I, I'm gonna change, I promise. You won't even recognize me. Hey, there you are. I was cracking. So, we all good? Hell yeah, we all good. We did. Yeah, you fucking ain't right, we did. So, here's the shot. Lester's offloading the gems. He knows a guy. Get us 50 cents on the dollar. <coughs> <laughs> Hell, we might actually have a little spending money left after we pay off that psychotic Mexican motherfucker. Whew. Cheers. So that's that, right? I hope so. The whole job. Everything about it. Anyone who knows your file, what is wrong with you? Davy, long time no see. And what about Trevor? If that fruitcake realizes, no, no, finds out you're alive, you are D-O-N-E fucked. Hey, don't worry about Trevor. Trevor's dead. Gotta be. Besides, I didn't have nothing to do with it. Whatever the hell it is you're talking about. Nothing. Really? Are believed to escape with millions of dollars worth of gems, oh. precious stones, and hey. rings. Albert's story had a lucky escape when the thieves ran straight into it. Yeah, I was just doing my job, and I said to this guy, "Hey, you gotta move these bikes." I don't know anything about that. When this other guy runs out of the shop, he pushes me over and says something like, "You forget thousands of things every day. You make sure this is one of them." That was pretty scary. 
Back to you in the studio. Uh-oh. He knows, I think. You want to get lit now, sugar? Tre Trevor, baby, you want to you wanna smoke up now? Don't do it, Johnny. Don't do it. Trevor! You been with my girl again? I'm speaking with you, asshole. Don't do it, Johnny. I told him, Trevor. I told him. We all get high. We all get high. But that don't Leave make it, it right. Johnny. Leave it. The crystal has got us, babe, but don't make it right. Don't make nothing right. Not what you're done with me. I'm telling Johnny, leave it. I ain't leaving nothing. Trevor, I'm talking to you, motherfucker. Are you? What are you saying? Fucking my girl, man. It's wrong. Oh, I gotta fuck someone. You want me to fuck you instead? I is that the problem here? <laughs> Take off your pants, cowboy. All right, let's let's fuck. You think this is funny? Get them off! I told him to leave it, Trevor. I told him leave it, leave it. Shut up, Ron. I'm about to fuck me a method, ain't I, cowboy? Get my boy sucked from his toothless gums. Hmm? Fuck you, Trevor. Oh, I still love her. Hey, I know. Hey, come on. Shh, I don't hey. mean nothing by it, man. So I just I know. I messed up. I know, cowboy. It's okay, man. Give me a hug. Yeah. yeah. You fucking shit! Cut! 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 Who the fuck are you speaking to? Who? Who? I'm talking to you, huh? You fuck! Johnny! Huh? Next time, don't get in my fucking face! I just saw a fucking ghost and I gotta hear your crap! Get up! Get up! Fuck you then! Johnny! Wait! <laughs> Fuck! Now, we gotta speak to Johnny's recently bereaved brothers. Hey, you seen Ashley? Johnny's looking for her. Well, you know, as a matter of fact, I just did just 10 minutes ago. Yeah, I saw her on the end of this penis here. Uh, Johnny ain't gonna be cool if you mess him with her again. Oh, really? Well, you don't think so, huh? Well, why don't we just ask him then, huh? Hey, hey, cowboy, you mind that I fucked your old lady? Sorry, what was that? Well, you know what? No, no, you don't mind? Oh, because you're a dead man? And the only sentient party you left is this little bit of brain and the gristle on the end of my boot? Well, thank you very much, cowboy. Bullshit! Oh, I like it, denial. That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? Oh, well, looks like you got something you want to say, huh? You got something you need to say? This better be bullshit. Oh, where are you guys going, huh? Let's go, ladies. Uh oh, right. oh, okay. We're already on a chase. The rest of them. Then the lost MC are out of this region for good. We got him! Yeah. There's the other one! You didn't see that coming! Alrighty, Root! Now we just sit on this guy till he gets to them. Ah. Did you see the look on their faces? We scared him, didn't we? Yeah! Thank fuck they didn't make you for the harmless idiots you are! You need some deep mouth back here! Or trapped or something! I only keep things in the back, I don't mind losing. Oh! Idiots! Come on! You letting him go on purpose, Trevor? Try saying that again! Sharp left! Slow it down! Uh, I can't see us taking out all the bikers this Come on. boss. I mean, there'll be some by that airstrip, and some over, you know, by that... If not today, their time will soon be upon them. Yeah.
we know where you're going yet? I got a feeling, yeah, but we gotta make sure. Once you know, you can drop me and Wade at the trailer. Maybe bring Chef to finish that. We do this now, Ron, all of us. Here we go. Come on. <laughs> right on top of him. Oh, look, look, they're pulling up. You did it, Trevor. They're stopping. Watch the entrance, boys. No one leaves without my express permission. It's not great. I only have a shotgun. Get you to anything? Soda? Snacks? No! Get in the fucking truck! Get back! <sighs> Wade? What are you still doing here? Are you said. I said go find a fucking ghost in Los Santos, alright? You looking for motivation? And get me some sticky bombs! <laughs> back up, okay. brother! Riverside Trader. He has techers? That makes me nervous. Ah, don't be nervous, nervous, Ron. He'll be fine with the takeover. Gonna buy Crystal fast as we can cook it. We just gotta meet him at the end, and Yeah, 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 yeah. Fine, yeah, okay. We're, we're nearly there. There he is. Let's wake him up. What? With the truck? No, come yeah, on. Yeah, the truck. Ortega runs the whole county. No, 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 no. Soggy friend, you are out of business. The lost MC are out of business. The guns and crank in this area go through Trevor Phillips Enterprise, or they ain't going. Saying something don't make it true. Ah! You get the picture. The shot callers ain't gonna be happy. I don't like the way he's looking at me. Feels better! You sure mean business, D. Yeah, the fucking ghost I've been talking about. He's alive? He's walking and he's talking. He's sticking up joints, so I guess, yeah, that makes him alive, don't it? And how you know it's him? It's his M.O. And it's the same corny shit he was spewing ten years back. This could be a trap, Trevor. 
What if someone wants you to think he's alive? I was fooled when I thought he was dead. I ain't fooled now. Michael Townley lives and breathes. He's in Los Santos, and he's got some explaining to do. They could be trying to draw you out into the open. That's a conspiracy theory too far, even for you, Ronald. Really? Well, anyway, it seems like a shame for you to be going, just as TP Industries is finding its feet. I'll do what I can to put the business on its path before I depart. Get out of the car, Ron. We need time to think. Run! <laughs> oh, Ron. Okay, I think that's going to do it for now. If you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more, just hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys in the next one.